Meanwhile, more than 100 Indonesian students are currently studying at a number of tertiary institutions in Turkey. Some of them are located in affected areas of the earthquake. And we will now find out about the latest condition with Indonesian Student Association head in Turkey, Safik Riskula. Hello, Safik. Yes, I wish you well in this critical uh, moment. Our first question, uh, Shafiq, could you tell us about the impact of the quake in your area? All right, for the impact of the quake is left, uh, the first thing is impactful for uh, uh, us, especially we are the students, uh, because the system of the patients itself is not clear enough right now whether we will conduct it in on offline and it's still the bad. But it's making it confused for us as a student of Indonesia who are studying in, in right now. Uh, instead of that, uh, the problems of the front make up because of the problem of the earthquakes itself. So it's called quite tough uh, today, uh, current situations uh, in Turkey because of the earthquake itself. Okay, and uh, what are the needs that are prioritized um, in, uh, in Syria? I mean, uh, what type of aid that are needed most by, uh, in, in Turkey? I mean, what are the type of aid that are needed most by the victims? All right, for the current, the uh, uh, Turkey society and also the society is got the uh, uh, clothes, the... Uh, the um, many many thing in it, including about the uh, uh, jacket and so on and so forth. But in terms of food, also a, a waters, a clean waters is the needed most for every uh, single people who are affected by the uh, uh, this Turkey society is already said like they already have a lot of clothes and t-shirts and so on and so forth, but in terms of uh, food and also water, it's still lack and uh, it's uh, still a need a lot of food and also a um, Shafiq, hi, Paul here. Um, we did mention there was around 100 uh, Indonesian students currently over there in Turkey. Have all of them been accounted for thus far? Uh, and in relation to everyone's um, situation, um, is everyone uh, in good health or is there another update in regards to that? And where is information being found uh, for you over there? All right. For the Indonesian society, especially Indonesian students, uh, thanks God for nowadays and current situation, they are really health. They are good in good conditions and they are already recovered. Uh, three of them are injured because of the earthquake, but now is already recovery and for uh, uh, years of the Indonesian students who are impacted by the earthquake, now they are in very good condition. And some of them are going to their family, their relative in Turkey, and also uh, they also plan to back to Indonesia. Right. So, uh, Shafiq, this is uh, Ahir speaking. So, we've got the information from the uh, uh, Indonesian embassy in Syria that uh, the uh, students, Indonesian students there uh, are also contributing for helping uh, the victims of the earthquake in Syria. How about in Turkey? So how, how's the contribution from the students uh, to contribute uh, for helping the victims, particularly for uh, Indonesian, uh, their victims in uh, Turkey? All right. Uh, it's very interesting uh, questions for me because in the very first time when the earthquake uh, happened, I'm as the uh, Indonesian uh, Students Association or uh, PPI, uh, we are directly uh, uh, try to creating uh, communication with every single student, Kahraman Maras, in Malatya, in Gantep, and also in uh, Hatay. We directly uh, calling them and also creating the coordination uh, in order to make sure uh, they are in a good condition and after that we creating the one uh, WhatsApp group is inside of the WhatsApp group itself uh, there are a diplomat 
and also from the defense uh, from the embassy of Indonesia in order to communications and also in order to make sure every single students of Indonesia in a good condition and also uh, uh, in the in one as uh, one place in order to make easier for the evacuate evacuation and, uh, alhamdulillah there are all of the Indonesian students are uh, being evacuated by the embassy because of the uh, also the coordinate coordination with the PPI or Indonesian uh, student society uh, besides of that we also getting a lot of donation until now this we almost got uh, four uh, four hundred million millions uh, wow. Indonesian rupiah in order to donating to every a single people in Turkey, Turkey society and also Indonesian society in order to uh, giving they need it. And not only that, uh, also from the Indonesian student of society, uh, giving the translator because it's really tough in Turkey because they are uh, just speaking in Turkish. So we are as a student uh, giving the sums of our student in order to be a translator to Basarnat and also to Afat as the uh, Turkish uh, disasters management. All right, Shafiq, thank you so much for your report and your update as well that we do hope that you and all the other brothers and sisters, both uh, be it Turkish or Indonesian, stay safe out there.